Damn. I did it. Yeah, you did. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See, you did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. Huh. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh uh. Okay. Now I have to cut her hair. Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. <laughs> Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Well, I think I remember what she says. And if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. I'm pretty sure she says, I'm gonna look like a boy. Something like that. Do you know how to do this? Yeah, of course. I don't believe you. Ha. <laughs> okay. Well, good. good? Means you know when someone's lying to you, which is another valuable survival skill. So you did kill someone before? Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Huh? Ah. Uh. No, it's different. But you do it now to protect yourself and to protect me. Yeah. Sent to jail. Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with some. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Hair <laughs> thingies. Yeah, Lily gave them to me for sleeping. Okay. There, all set. Wow. <laughs> dumb. <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. I'm sure she said something about looking like a boy, but no, obviously not. She looks so upset. Okay, now we go back to the front of the train. With to whiskey. Okay. I don't actually know if he's a drunk or if he just likes the odd drink now and again. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. One nip. Uh no. Nah, I'm fine. Suit yourself. Okay. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Kenny. That's the only person that you can send out for a drink. Hey, man. You and me, we. Uh, let's just get to the ocean. What? Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Good. Now I can get the map. Thanks. Okay. To over here. It was me. 
What? Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? what? It's all my fault. What are my options? Jesus, Ben. I know. They said they had my friend. That he was with just, them. Just stop. Fuck. Can we even trust you? Yes. Why'd you have to go and tell me that? I just... No. Just don't tell anybody. You can't take any of it back, so don't. Okay. Ah, oh dear. Ben, you idiot. You're an idiot. Ah, right, let's do this plan. Hey, Clint. Hi. Talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. They don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. Hmm. To help find a boat, it's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. I know. Look. No, I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Uh. Where would we even look? I can remember where they were staying. Maybe they didn't go far. Clementine. Please, Lee. All right. Let's figure it out on the map, but. A boat is the ultimate plan. Yes, they can come with us, right? Yes. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. We're gonna want to look for a boat here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the savannah to the southwest of us. Now we've got a good chunk of savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh, hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M. M. something Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! Okay. So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know. Uh, yeah. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little shot. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh, shit! Hold on, everybody! Oh. Damn, that's loud. Oh, jeez. Fuck, 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 fuck! Maybe we could walk? That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's mm -hmm. not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. Yeah. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This ain't shit. <gasps> Yo, you keep screaming like that and you're gonna hey. get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Uh No, we're friendly. Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? 
Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. Okay. Let's put my faith in stuff. Oh dear. Oh. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. Wow. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. <laughs> this is great! See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? Hmm. I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. We've been together ever since. And everybody down there, they're cool? Yep. Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know. Uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. A train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. Okay. We appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Okay. Oh, yeah. Let's open this stop signs. Wait, what is that? Oh, search. I wonder what the hell are we doing then? Not the only useful thing in here. Okay. What the hell is this? Oh, it's a generator. Oh! Right back down we go. Guys, this is Omid and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. It's time we move forward. Omid and Krista are gonna help and we're gonna get past this damn tanker. We're happy to stick around. We'll see about that. You wanna start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Someone might want to have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. Okay. I think Chuck's playing a song. Right, let's go to the station. You don't like the new girl? I do, but it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah. yeah. All right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. Hmm. I don't know why, but I'm really tempted to just record until the end of the game. So, like, finish off The Walking Dead today. It's only got about f three or four hours left. Probably not even that. But, we'll see. Survivor's inside, apparently. Actually, what I'm going to do is finish off this episode, get some food, and then do the final two, maybe? Yeah. We'll see. You should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. 
Hmm. There's that thing on the top. The window's open up there. Maybe I could look in? Yeah. Let's do it. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. Ugh. Okay. I can see in. What do I do now? Um. What do you see? Lots of crates and stuff. Maybe okay. we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock, which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. Hmm. Well, I'll be I'll damned. Be damned. Oh wow. I didn't even know he said that. That was just pure luck. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you. <laughs>